Benji families. As many of you know, my name is Melissa Hansen and I work here at Benji. Today I'm going to share an activity with you. Pastor Dane just got done telling you a Bible story about different things and about broken promises. In your packet, there's several activities you can do to help illustrate this, but I'm going to show you one with just a simple craft that comes from using a piece of string and a scissors. So if you want to find yourself a string or a rope or a broken shoelace or something to help do this, please go ahead and find that now. Also, going forward in future weeks, if you ever see that there's something you would like to do but you don't have the materials, please let us know and I would be happy to get them to you. So today, when we talk about making promises with other people and breaking them, I just wanted to show you a little bit of what that looks like. So in your packet, it talks about, you know, using family members to use a ball of string and pass it from one person to the other, but if you don't have others in your house, I'm going to show you how to do this by yourself. So I have a piece of string here, and if I stretch it out, and I pretend this is a promise that I made to someone, and I hold it like this, see how it connects me and the other person together, because it's one piece of string. But if I take my scissors, and I cut that in half, cut it in half, now what happens? Now I have two pieces. I no longer have that connection or that promise I made with the other person because I broke it. Thus, there I have two pieces of string. So what happens when you break a promise with something or someone is you break that connection or that bond you have with two other people. So that's a simple idea just to take a look at to see what happens if you break a promise to someone, whether it be to your friends or to your parents or to your grandparents. So now if you want to go ahead and try that, also there's other activities if you want to look through your packets and see if you want to do that as well. I'm excited to see you all soon. I hope that you enjoyed this lesson and we will talk to you later.